I'm expert enough for you. So what, are, what are you pouring there, Jason? I'm going to pour some uh, Marie Brizard Curacao Blue. I couldn't find blue Curacao. I had to no. get the Curacao Blue. It's yeah. uh, it's all the other way around. It's, it doesn't make any sense. Um, One and a half ounces. So I mean, what are you, you going to pour? What are you going to drink those? Such out? a terrifying looking liquid. <laughs> it just doesn't. Yeah. It looks like it's it's from a one of those. It looks class. like from high school chemistry class, doesn't it? If you have, like, if I ever That's had a doubt this was going to turn a drink blue, <laughs> all I have to do is realize how blue this blue curacao is. I'm surprised that our tongues aren't blue after <laughs> drinking this stuff. Yeah. Maybe they are. One and a half ounces of blue curacao in an ounce of Galliano. Now, this is where I get scared, because I think that the Galliano is going to turn the blue green. But maybe the, maybe the blue is so super... Super glue. Super glue? <laughs> yeah. Two ounces of super glue? <laughs> what? Uh-oh. For those of you following along live at home, strike that. <laughs> it's not super blue. Mm. Or is it super blue? It's not super glue. Oh, it's greenish oh. somewhat. It is. Like mm. vanilla -y root beery Galliano. Galliano should be drank all the time. I think it's an unsung hero. I think it gets a bad rap by being used in the Harvey Wallbanger. It should be used in more things. All right. And that's the final word from Chase and Deadly. <laughs> and two ounces of pineapple juice. Oh, and for this, we're using Sunripe, hundred percent juice, no sugar added. No, we don't do that. I brought uh, I brought some uh, pineapple juice back from Hawaii. I brought the little cans. Yeah. So I found them. It was great. You don't get the little cans here. I thought it was great. It's Dole. Yeah. Okay, well, what could be more authentic? And so I was taking a look at it uh, <laughs> for tonight, and I was reading the fine print. Right. And it's made in the Philippines. <laughs> Yeah, it's in Hawaii, so... <laughs> My guess was it was going to be actually from uh, Costa Rica or something. <laughs> yes. uh, sometimes if you search hard mm -hmm. in the ethnic section of your grocery store, mm -hmm. you'll find the Philippines uh, little cans of, uh, of pineapple juice. And that way you don't have to commit to a whole uh, half liter of uh, pineapple <laughs> juice. I did have uh, I did have some they weren't because I thought we we're gonna do, do double I could have brought the two cans that would have been good or one can oh you should have brought your two cans that would have been oh, awesome yeah yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. oh we're using these guys perfect I think yeah those are the glasses are. I can see <laughs> no I don't know why I said that <laughs> and I don't know why I was so surprised as well oh my god we're gonna have drinks <laughs> yeah haven't you been making a drink for the past fifteen minutes yeah <laughs> I have. All right, so this is, uh, now this is, remember, this is if you're at your gender uh, announcement party. Are you sure? And your child is going to be, uh, in theory, a boy. And you wanted to have a blue drink to make all of the expectant mothers drink. Oh, okay. This is the one you would do. This is called blue ice. And it involves some shaking. Does it? So, Starting when? Um, now! Right. Well, this was built by the same people that did the Commodore Ballroom. <laughs> That's going to be great. I think it will be. Let's release this here. Oh, this is definitely blue. Is it? Okay. So I'm going to get... Uh... Look at that. Oh, look at that. That's... So people would say, it's a boy! And if they're this... Italian. <laughs> And again, our little, our little cups are awful small, and my pouring just, ratio is off. But we're getting there, aren't we? Is that pretty good? Right. Well, I will. I do work on the weekends as uh, I do bar mitzvahs, bat mitzvahs. But mostly, I do a gender announcement party. <laughs> I can tell you, you've been talking it up all all night. <laughs> Like, Garnish it with a hunk of pineapple mm -hmm. and a lovely um, uh, uh, preserved cherry of some sort. Where, what kind did you get here? These are maraschino cherries by Luxardo. Oh, Luxardo. Thank you oh, very much, sir. You're welcome. But they're, they tend to be on the wee side, so I've got some chukka cherries for my next batch. Chukka cherries?